Um, it's not lost on me that my forearms look like they get completely lost when I do this. Um, I would get a lot of grief about it. <laughs> Uh, like when I post shorts and I'm doing curls and all that stuff. Just like I get grief about my legs, you know? You aren't going to be seeing any squats or deadlifts today. This is an arm workout. Um, I know it's been a while. But because I am almost at the end of my bulk, I thought it would be a good time to capture this um, for myself. It'll be nice to have a before and after of what I look like at like 165 versus uh, 140, which is where I'm typically at with the exception of this like past year where I've tried this intentional bulk. So yeah, things are fitting me a little bit more uh, uh, tight. My sweaters are definitely tighter. My shirts, my jeans, everything is a bit tighter. I am looking forward to the cut. I'm tired of eating as much as I have been. And uh, it's definitely tough because I do fast. So trying to everything within that eight hour window um, is pretty tough definitely would be a lot easier if I wasn't fasting and also the running that I do um, so that definitely doesn't help as far as trying to put on weight going to be doing a bit of cables today I'm gonna be doing some dumbbell work um, and I'm gonna be doing some curl bar work I'm gonna be doing a little bit of everything I just try and get a nice pump going I'm gonna hit a little bit of a warm-up and uh, get right into it so uh, Let's get it. Uh. <sighs> so today I'm just gonna be doing a few sets of eight for like my top set. I hope you don't mind the mess. Um, this is a garage after all, so <laughs> uh, we do store things in here. It's not just my gym, as much as I wish it was just my gym. Now I just move right into some biceps. I've been a little bit more intentional with some of the exercises that I do this time around, especially because of this bulk um, and trying to actually put on a little bit of muscle. So I've really enjoyed doing the cable work. Uh, 
definitely makes for a really awesome pump. <laughs> uh, can't hate on that, especially on arm day. Switched out the attachment, so it's just gonna be a little straight bar. But we're still doing some cable work. It hurts so good. I've been trying to be better with like my time management while I'm in here and not give myself such a long break because I'll always get distracted whether I'm on my phone or something crosses my mind and I want to look it up right away which is really stupid because nothing's ever that important while I'm in here um, so I had to download this freaking app uh, I don't know if you can see it or not, but it's essentially just a little rest timer um, and it lets me know once my minute is up and then it just resets to the amount of time that you want to give yourself rest wise uh, and then you can just restart it. Kind of weird that the iPhone doesn't just have that um, because I can set a timer and then I have to get back into it and you probably hear it right now. But yeah, uh, so I ended up having to try a few different apps until I found one that kind of just did the job for me. I mean, it's not perfect because it's not like I start right away as soon as the timer goes off. Um, but it does kind of keep me in check just because, again, I just get so distracted while I'm in here. Jumping right into tricep sets. Uh, I'm doing like 
three sets for each exercise, um, three top sets, um, heavy weight, whatever, or my heavier weight. So yeah, I'll do three of these right now and then probably change the attachment one more time or yeah, we'll see. Um, but I'm gonna stick to the cable before moving on to uh, um, the curl bar. So. is feeling pretty good already <sighs> I knew it was gonna be a little too heavy. Doesn't look like it, but it's feeling good. I know there's not much weight on here, but hey, I'm not trying to be a hero. I'm just trying to get a solid workout.
see how pronated curls feel with this weight. It's a little bit lighter, but I'll probably end up cheating. <laughs> yeah. feel too terrible I'm gonna try and go back to the other way and see if I can get anything oh all right let's see if these are total trash or not I didn't hate it. I always feel like triceps are like some of the toughest um, exercises to kind of capture uh, or I just do a really terrible job of like getting the right angles uh, for tricep exercises so <laughs> I really hate recording tricep workouts that's probably why you don't see a lot of them um, on my channel like as far as like shorts and all that On to the next tricep exercise. Um, some like overhead tricep extension, overhead press thing. I honestly, I, I'm terrible with exercises, so <laughs> exercise names, all that ish. Um, eccentric, concentric, whatever, all that stuff that I was thinking about earlier. Like, I, yeah, so uh, knock me for it, whatever. Um, I switched out um, curl bars. The one that I was using was rackable. 
This one isn't, so the weights sit inside of the J cups. So it's a little funky to uh, like, uh, load and unload, but for this, um, I like it because of the fact that it's just easier to manage since it's not as long. Um, and I end up having to like play a balancing game a little bit when I'm doing these uh, with the rackable curl bar. So I tend to swap it out for this shorter one. one dumbbell exercise for bicep and then one for tricep and then I'm gonna do my finisher just uh, to get that last pump in so yeah it's, I mean it's feeling pretty good so I'm just going <laughs> uh, I really don't need these last two I don't think
Exercise and for triceps. the cable to do this finisher for biceps and then a finisher for triceps totally unnecessary but sometimes I just get completely lost um, in the pump I get lost in arm day like I just enjoy the heck out of it so <laughs> sometimes I do a lot of unnecessary ish this one is unnecessary the last two exercises uh, were definitely unnecessary but I'm just trying to squeeze everything that I can out of this um, it's not lost on me that my forearms look like they get completely lost when I do this. Um, I get a lot of grief about it. <laughs> uh, like when I post shorts and I'm doing curls and all that stuff. Just like I get grief about my legs, you know? I would say that it's definitely the angles, but it also doesn't help that my arms right now, especially that I'm bulking, like they just, they're huge. Come on. <laughs> uh, I don't hate it, but I do get a lot of hate, um, whatever. Uh, so I am gonna try and do um, a clean set of sevens. Um, and then I did drop the weight on this um, to try and make sure that I get a clean set. And once I do that, I'm gonna move to triceps finisher and uh, yeah, call it. To the tricep finisher this one was on that uh coach eugene instagram he 
put this up. It looks a little bit different um, than your typical tricep extension exercise. I'm gonna see if I don't botch this uh, and forget um, how to do it. We'll see how this looks too on here. I don't know if I captured that correctly or if I did it 100% correctly, but yeah, that's it. <laughs> don't worry, that wasn't for you. That was for me. Uh, make sure that I can compare myself to my peak bulk uh, versus later uh, when I'm down on my lower weight. I'm excited for the cut, uh, but I really wanted to shoot this uh, video because I wanted to make sure that I captured myself um, 20, 25 pounds heavier. It depends what the scale reads uh, this weekend. I'm not typically at this weight, so I really wanted to capture that uh, with an arm workout, especially for the pumps, you know? <laughs> See how jacked and huge I look and feel now versus how much of a runner's body I have once I'm down to uh, my typical weight. Uh, yeah, I was looking at the short that I made last year uh, when I was showing like an arm pump and I was like, holy smokes. Like I, I mean, I'm a small dude regardless, you know, I'm not a very big guy, but looking back at that video i was like holy smokes like i i uh, i look like a like a runner like i i, I mean i i love to run i am a runner <laughs> but i just it's crazy because unless you have like images or or video of yourself like during these like changes like it's hard to believe sometimes so yeah it definitely caught me off guard but that's it. If you're still getting an arm workout today or you're getting any type of workout, let's get it. Thanks again for watching. This is your boy, LJ, and I'll catch you next time.